One of the big questions of the study is whether wolverines are crossing the Trans-Canada. Um, we have had a few sightings over several years of them coming, um, traveling on the underpasses. Um, but this is a perfect site. We've got a wolverine we just found on the north side of Highway 1. So it'd be interesting to see if we find the same DNA on the south side. Um, so just the overall picture looking for gene flow across the highway. It's been up for about a month. Um, so hopefully we have some hair. Uh, hopefully wolverine came by. So we'll check the barbed wire, um, check the camera, see, see what we have in the images. Um, probably Martin, hopefully Wolverine. Oh yeah, there it is. It's good, it's totally gone except for the tail. Is that, uh, is that feces over there? Oh, there's one. Got some hair here. That's a little ring here. Yeah. Yeah. That's a little ring. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's a little ring. 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 Oh yeah, that's a little kind of typical of what we've been seeing with wolverine hair. It's long, little kinked, kind of curly, black. Um, so the whole length of the hair is got about here, a couple inches. Um, we're also finding some scat around, um, and that's also characteristic of, they seem to have a latrine nearby, um, maybe marking their spot. So this is exciting, we got wolverine. <laughs> Still running normally? Card out. This will be a good card with the Wolverine pictures. <laughs> Hopefully. <laughs>